Hey guys! For today, I am very excited to share with you this new product from Etude House. I recently visited Etude House at SM North Edsa. So, I got this product. I'll show you in a bit. So, shout out to my blockmate Lynn for telling me about this product. So, this is the Tint My Brows Gel. Uh, my friend told me that you just put it on and then you peel it off and that it will stay there for a week or so. But then I asked the sales lady from my tooth house. She told me that it will stay up to four days about that time. So this is how the product looks like. I mean, the this is how the packaging looks like. So this is the actual tube. It's, ju it's just... Um, quite small so I bought the shade number 2 because nung nagpunta ko before they only have two shades available it's either this one the lighter shade or um, the ash no it's a grey brown one so it's kind of too dark for my skin tone and also for my hair because my hair is still in its ombre state so ito na lang kinuha ko Actually, I think it would be better if I got the the shade in the middle kasi feeling ko yun yung mas shade ko. Pero I really wanted to try it out kaya I bought the lighter shade instead. Korean kasi nasa box kaya hindi ko maintindihan. So this is in the shade light brown. Ito, English. Tint my brows gel. Number 2 light brown. New concept eyebrow gel tint that makes eyebrow makeup last longer after removing the tint. Directions. After trimming the eyebrows without applying skincare product or makeup, apply a liberal amount according to the desired shape of the eyebrow. Apply a liberal amount to remove the pack easily. Dry for at least 2 hours. 2 hours? For stronger coloration applying before going to bed at night and remove the next morning ah at least 2 hours so if gusto mo mas matagal magstay yung color it's better to put it on overnight after drying completely remove slowly starting from the head of the eyebrow do not remove the pack forcibly since it may pull out the eyebrow okay that's scary do not use a cleansing product product with detergency or apply force on the eyebrow area within 24 hours of using the product beauty tips if skin is too oily or it has lots of dead skin cells tidy up the eyebrow surrounding skin before applying the pack to ensure good coloring if you make a mistake in drawing correct or wipe clean correct or wipe clean with cotton swab or clean tissue before it completely dries out. Here. Ayun, ang sabi sa box. So, for today, I did not do my brows yet. Kaya, excuse my eyebrows. Oh yeah, this brow gel costs 528 pesos in any Etude House branches out there. So, ito na. Let's try it out. Ngumumula yung dito kasi kinamat ko siya kanina. Okay, ito siya. Yung consistency niya, it's very jelly and the brow gel. <laughs> and sticky siya, sticky siya. I think may hirapan lang ako dito sa applicator kasi masyado siyang makapal. So, I think Pagka ilalagay mo to kailangan sobrang galing mo maglagay ng eyebrow tint or sobrang precise ng pagkalagay mo. So, ito siya on my hand here. Actually, the test ko muna here and then I'll show you guys after. This tube contains 5 grams of brow gel inside. 
So just to clarify, there are three shades available according to the sales assistant at the Tude House. Pero during my visit yesterday, they only have two shades available. This one and the darker. This one is the lightest one and the darkest one. So ang kinuha ko na lang is this one. So it's been about five minutes since pinastay ko to. So ngayon... It's not yet fully dried, pero I can just swipe it off. And try ko muna siya i-peel off. I don't know if I if you can see that. And ah, Okay, nag-dry na siya. Yun yung sin watch ko. So, this is the color here. Yung mga hindi natanggal, big sabi it's not yet fully dried. Kaya ganyan. Okay, so now I'm going to try it on my eyebrows. So, make sure na wala daw product. Just comb it out. Okay. I'm actually nervous to put this on. Okay. Here it goes. Parang nakakatakot. Kasi if you put it dito, sa area na to, baka maging isang solid color lang siya eh. E ba? When you, when you do your eyebrows, dapat faded on this part to make it look more natural looking. Medyo may Europe shade lagay ah. <laughs> yung scent pala niya, amoy, alam mo yung amoy ng nose pack from Eye White. Parang ganun. Pero, mas mabango siya ng konti. Meron siyang perfume. And mabango naman. Ang dami mo palang magagamit dito na product. So, I'm not sure if gaano katagal magla-last ang isong tube. You need to be very careful with this. Sobrang... Para feeling ko, there's no area for mistakes kapag ka ginagamit mo to kasi kilay yan eh <laughs> for me kasi sobrang okay na sa akin kilay kilay lashes and I'm good to go okay so dito na ako sa medyo tricky part dito sa front area Kasi dapat light lang dito. Hindi ko alam kung paano ko magagawang light yung dito sa area na to. Pero dito, dark. Okay. Dito sa middle part and sa tail part of my eyebrows, ang ginawa ko is I just placed the applicator pag ganun lang. Pag ganun. Pero when it comes dito sa front part of my brows, ang ginawa ko is uh, little strokes lang. Para hindi masyadong dark sa area na to. Define ko lang konti yung tail ng brows ko. Now, I'm just going to do it on my other eyebrow. Disclaimer pala, I am not sponsored by Etude House or whatsoever. I'm just really trying, I just really wanted to try this product out. Okay, medyo tricky maglagay dito sa kabila kasi I'm right-handed.
I hope my eyebrows are even there. So I think that's the best I can do with applying. So I'll be back after two hours since ang sabi dito, I have to put it on for at least two hours. So just an update, about 20 minutes has passed and fully dried na siya. So now it's time to peel this off. Ngayon, sa 2 hours ngayon, I noticed na yung ends niya, it started to peel off on its own. Here. Ito. Now, I'm going to peel it off na. I'm just going to gently scratch off the gel. Oh yeah, dito sa sinwatch ko kanina, I noticed na ito yung sinwatch ko kanina, tapos tinanggal ko after 5 minutes. And this one, this is the first swatch that I made. And tinanggal ko siya after mga 20 minutes. So, I'm guessing na the longer you uh, put this gel, mas darker siya na lalabas. So, that's just a guess. Sobrang dark nito. Um, to think na this is the lightest shade already. I mean, buti na lang hindi ko kinuha yung gray, gray brown shade. Don't force your eyebrows kasi you might pull the hair. Wow. So wrong. Instant brows. And I think I could I could work with this color. And now I'm going to remove the other side. So that is the final result. I think okay na ako sa shade na to. Good thing I got the lightest shade. Kasi ang dark na niya. And I really love this. Okay. Sobrang okay siya for summer. Lalo na if you're going out for a swim. Um, if gusto niyo lagi kayong may kilay. This is really a good product. So for me, um, this product is very convenient to use. It's very easy to use. This is good for vacation. Ganyan. Yun nga yung sabi ko if gusto mo mag-swimming or what. Tapos, it is also good for lazy people, yung mga um, ayaw mag-makeup everyday. It will just stay here. Hindi mo kailangan gawin yung eyebrows mo everyday. Tapos, um, the price range is okay kasi 528 pesos and your eyebrows will stay on for about a week or so. Tapos, I think okay naman yun. And the shade that I got is also really good for my hair color. I think this matches me well. Ayan. And also, the brow gel will also dry up sa unang 20 minutes pa lang. Kaya, if you're planning to do the overnight procedure, yung isi-stay on mo, yung ilalagay mo yung eyebrow gel, tapos matutulog ka, tapos pipil off man lang the next day, okay lang kasi hindi magpupunta sa bed sheet mo or sa pillows mo yung brow gel. Yung mga con naman for me is you really have to be precise sa paglagay mo nito. Kasi kung, kung hindi precise yung paglagay mo, uh, papangit yung pagkalagay ng kilay mo kasi magiging magkakaroon siya ng mga lampas-lampas. So, pangit naman kung ganun. Also, ayoko rin masyado yung applicator nito kasi yung applicator nito masyadong um, thick para maging precise yung application. So, sana um, thinner lang yung brush na to and ma magiging okay na siya sa tingin ko. Also, the color selection is a little small to think na hindi naman true to color yung mga shade at yung actual shade niya. Kasi sabi dito, light brown. This is light brown. Ang sabi dito, light brown. What more kung yung shade is... Kung yung other two shades are darker than this one. So, that's the dark brown and the 
um, gray brown. So, buti na lang, I got the light brown. Kasi sobrang dark na nito for me. I mean, di, kasi sobrang sakto nito for me. You have to groom your brows before applying this to be able to have the most precise eyebrows that you would want. Kasi nga, um, kapag ka marami kang stray hair around your eyebrows, magi magiging lampas-lampas yung pag-apply mo. Now, if you think that you're an ex, if you if you think that you can um, line your eyebrows well, naman okay lang. Pero um, para rin maging guide for you, um, it is better to get your eyebrows groomed first, or you can groom your own brows first before applying this brow gel. Yun lang yung thoughts ko for today. Now I'm going to test the longevity of this product. So I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye. Excuse my no makeup face. I went out just to buy coffee. Today is second day of my eyebrows. So for today, um, napansin ko na medyo naglighten ng konte yung eyebrows ko. Uh, ayan. So I think nagiging true to color na yung light brown. I took a bath last night after filming, and then I washed my face this morning again. So nabasa na siya twice. So, ayun. Habang tumatagal, nag-fade siya. Anyway, I'll check back again tomorrow. Hey guys! So, today is day 3 of my eyebrows. So, today, napansin ko lang na medyo mas naging faded yung edge area niya. So, I think for today, okay pa naman yung eyebrows ko if I don't put any brow powder or any brow product for my makeup. Kaya... Ayon, that's it for today. I'll check back again tomorrow. Hey guys, so today is day 4 of my eyebrows. So, ito na siya ngayon. Uh, today, I'll be attending an event. And I did uh, light makeup on my face today. So, since I'm wearing makeup, I feel like my eyebrows are too patchy. Um, what I'll do today is I'll just fill in my brows with brow powder para somehow hindi siya maapektuhan with the color. Pero, para lang makita, this is the results for day 4. Uh, when I'm not wearing any makeup on, maganda pa siya. Ang ganda niya tignan kapag ka walang makeup on. I, I wish I filmed that earlier. But, but anyway, this is my update for day 4. I'll check back again tomorrow. And just to show you, Finil... Finil in ko lang yung eyebrows ko using a brown eyebrow powder para magmatch yung color. So this is my eyebrows filled in. Sobrang light lang yung pag-fill in ko na Finil in ko lang yung sparse areas. Hey guys! So I'm wearing the same thing again kasi I just got home from the hospital. I spent the night there to take care of my mom. Today is day 5 of my um, Etude House Tint My Brows Gel tutorial and this would be probably my last update kasi as you can see um, sa, sa end part and dito sa front part sobrang faded na niya um, if, I'm not wear, if I'm not going to wear any makeup on okay pa siya kasi mukha lang siyang naturally full yung eyebrows but then, if I'm going to wear light makeup or what or whatsoever, um, mag mag fill in ako ng brows na. So it's either I retouch with this or I fill in my eyebrows with my normal brow routine. All in all, the long for me the longevity of this brow tint lasted for five days. Yun yung naging result sa experience ko with the with this product. I hope this review helped you a lot sa mga gustong itry yung same product. Sana natulungan ko kayo to, to decide whether or not to try this product. So that's it for my review video. I hope to see you on my next one. Bye!